Commissioner Precinct 2. Here. Gary Thickus, Commissioner Precinct 3. Here. J.D. Johnson, Commissioner Precinct 4. Here. Constitutes Present. a quorum. Our invocation today will be delivered by Bishop Kenneth Spears from the First St. John's Missionary Baptist Church in Fort Worth. Bishop, thank you for coming out today. After the invocation, please remain standing for our pledges. It's a powerful word of prayer. God, our Father, how we thank you and praise you for such a wonderful day. And we pray for your guidance, for your direction. We pray and we ask, Lord, these things that we decide on today will be according to your will. We thank you and bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. Bishop, thank you for coming out this thank morning. You. Appreciate it. Mr. Manius, agenda announcements. Thank you, Your Honor. We have one announcement this morning as it relates to the agenda. Despite Commissioner Johnson's um, um, suggestion that we can, that we do the outside burning ban today, since it uh, <laughs> since he had about four inches of rain last night. Uh, under the administrator section, item 8A1, we're going to hold that for one week. I'm surprised you didn't call with a bad weather day today. <laughs> Can I do that? <laughs> Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you. Court members, you have before you the minutes of our regular meeting of June the 22nd. Move for approval. Second. We have a motion to second. Any discussion? Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Uh, proclamations and resolutions. Commissioner Brooks, I believe you have one. Ask for ratification of the congratulatory certificate uh, granted to Plaza Medical Center of Fort Worth. Second. We have a motion and a second. Any discussion? <coughs> Vote. Motion passes unanimously. Court members, you have before you the consent agenda. Move approval. Second. We have a motion and a second to approve the consent agenda. Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Mr. Manius. Thank you, Your Honor. Members of the court, we have one final item for you this morning. This is A2. We're requesting that the commissioner's court receive the annual independent financial audit for Tarrant County for the fiscal year ended September 30th, uh, 2009. This is the first uh, audit that we've had with KPMG, our new outside financial auditor. I believe that uh, we've provided that in electronic form and a paper form to uh, the court members. This is simply a receiving file. So moved. Second. second. We have a motion to second. GK, I did have a few questions I wanted to ask you about that, but you know, I'll I go was, ahead and put those off till later on. And I was prepared. <laughs> <laughs> Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you, GK. Ray, as your uh, uh, request, requesting authorization for the approval of uh, the purchase and training of the dog, it's going to be housed with uh, the Bedford Police Department, I believe. Move approval. Second. We have a motion to second. Any discussion? Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Thank you. Ms. Glenn? I move to receive and file personnel agenda. Second. We have a motion and a second to receive and file personnel agenda. Any discussion? Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Thank you. Thank you for the Ray exercise. Was, Ray was blocking my path. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Beecham. Welcome back, Mr. Beach. Thank you. It's all right. You, we missed you. I missed y'all too. Yeah, I'll bet. Go right ahead. We have three items for your consideration this morning. Our first item is a bid award recommendation for our bid, number 2010-076. This is our annual contract for automotive radiator, uh, radiator repair. 
Recommendations to award a per unit price basis awarding to Kirby's Radiator. Move for approval. Second. We have a motion to second. Any discussion? Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Our number two item is also a bid award recommendation for our bid number 2010 079. This is another annual contract for tire repairs and service, uh, countywide uh, usage. Recommendation is to award a per unit price basis awarding to the primary, secondary, and alternate vendors as shown in your court communique. Move for approval. Second. We have a motion and several seconds. <laughs> Any discussion? Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Last item also is a bid award recommendation for our bid number 2010-083. This is our annual contract for signpost and anchor material breakaway. Uh, recommendation is to award this on a pre price basis. Select as our primary vendor, Allied 2 and Conduit Corporation. As our secondary vendor, Centerline Supply. Move approval. Second. We have a motion to second. Any discussion? Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Sheriff? I think we've given Jack a bad flashback, so I want we're going to uh, sing Kumbaya. Yeah, I'm going <laughs> to. We gave, we gave Jack a, real, a bad moment here. We're going to request that the commissioner's court approve uh, our department to participate in the Texas 1033 surplus uh, property program. And as you may remember or not remember, we had some issues with that in the prior administration. It's where they tended to get stuff uh, and they didn't properly uh, document it and account for it and dispose of it. And it caused the purchasing department, among many others, some, some heartache and grief. And Jack and I have had a discussion about this. And I've assured him, and I'm here to assure you all today, that uh, we will uh, properly inventory, document, maintain, and dispose of it. And we will not accept anything from the program without prior approval from the commissioner's court. So we don't want anyone to have a bad feeling about this. We don't want anyone to think that we're uh, in the business of stockpiling toys and bazookas and tanks or whatever. What brought this to the forefront was in our budget request for next year, we need new walk-through metal detectors. We got notice that there was a warehouse full of walk-through metal detectors for the taking for free. Mm. And we weren't signed up to participate in this program. Therefore, we lost out on them. Hmm. And so occasionally things like this arise that we will find that will do us benefit. and. Uh, you know, it was a substantial amount of money we could have saved out of the, our budget request for the new walk-through metal detectors had we been uh, hooked into this program. And so our desire is to not let that happen again. But I did want to assure Jack and, and everyone that this was not an end around or anything to, to get to where we used to be on this. Thank you, Sheriff. Move approval. Second. We have a motion and a second. Any discussion? We're not buying helicopters. We don't even say that word, Commissioner. That's not even allowed. I believe you said that word. We, before we'd attempted to build our own Air Force and Navy and some other stuff, and Dean and I have already talked about that. And uh, the only real concern I have, a lot of times when you when you find a sole source something, it costs you more money uh, to uh, set up a service agreement. So hopefully when that uh, when you're out searching, and Dean assured me that it would be a, a limited number of people that would be looking for this stuff or going out to look at what was available. And as long as it's disposed of and, and uh, properly, and uh, I think it's a great program, and I appreciate him delaying this uh, week till I could come back and, and, and listen to this. But he and I talked about it, and uh, we're good with it, very good with it. Thank you. Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Commissioner Fickus, I believe you have an interlocal agreement. I do. With, it's with the city of South Lake to purchase li liquid asphalt. Move for approval. Second. We have a motion to second. Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Any appointments? The one appointment I would reappointment that I would like to make is uh, Victor Vandergriff to the NTTA board. Uh, his term is coming up, I believe, uh, next month, and so I'd like to just go second. ahead. This one. We have a motion to second. Any discussion? Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Uh, you have before you the claims, including the addendum. Move for approval of the claims, including the addendum. Second. We have a motion and second to approve the claims, including the addendum. Please vote. Motion passes unanimously. Briefing items, Mr. Manius. Thank you, Your Honor. Members of the court, we do not have any briefing items for you at this time. However, 
uh, whenever we come back from closed, we're going to be going into a work session mode in 504C in which we're going to be discussing the civil courts building, both the interior layout of the building and also the exterior. So that will occur after closed session. And that shouldn't be a very long period of time, I would No, uh, No, sir. The Commissioner's Court will now recess open session and proceed to closed session to discuss items exempted.